If you want to knit some mittens, one, get a sheep. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Two, keep her warm and well fed through the long chilly winter. Wish for mittens, wait for spring. Three, in spring, your sheep might beg for a mohawk or for a pig. No, sheep tails. But scraggly sheep need a neat, complete buzz cut. Four, soak the dirty fleece in soapy water. Rinse out grass and food and dirt. Sheep are not the cleanest creatures. Uh, no offense meant sheep. A barn is not a cleanest place. Five, gently press the fleece to squeeze out the water. Mm. Riding your bike over it does not work. Six, once it's dry, pick the fleece into pieces. Then use bristly pads to card them. This untangles the fibers. It does not work on people's hair. Seven, spin your wispy wool into yarn. Let your spinning wheel hum and sing your sheep to sleep. Eight, choose a color for your mittens. Sunny gold. Great, but chances are your sheep did not grow gold wool. Nine, quick, plant some marigolds. You need soil, sun, and water. Ten, wait. Eleven, wait. Twelve, wait. Well, nobody said this would be a quick project. 13. Pick marigolds and dry them in the sun. Jumping rope nearby is not recommended. Ah. 14. Make an icky mixture and soak your yarn in it. This step helps the dye stick better later. It only looks like noodle soup. Remove the new uh, yarn and rinse it off. 15. Soak your marigolds in water. It's marigold magic sheep. 16. Cook your yarn in marigold dye. 17. Then spread your yarn out to dry. You might think it would make a cool mummy costume. It would not. 18. Get some knitting needles and learn to knit. Let your fingers fly. Click, clack, slip, snip. Knit your mittens. Wait for winter. Woo! Now slip on your mittens. Hold the golden sun in your hands. Have a warm and wooly winter with your friend Sheep.